Hello and welcome to Ignite Guitar Intermediate 201. This is week 7, let's get started. Last week we talked about bar chords and the bar chord families, and we're actually going to go over and look at A7 and G7 um, first as a review. So we're going to play A7, uh, week 6, page 40. Um, second and third finger are going to be on the second fret. We're playing the second finger on the fourth string, second fret, and third finger on the second string, second fret. We're playing the bottom five strings. Um, the X is on the sixth string, which means that's closed. So here's our A7. We're going to play the week six strum pattern, which is down, up, 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 one, and, 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 and. Let's play the A7 together. And we'll probably eventually switch over from A7 to, uh, to D and to G, so be ready for those chords. Um, let's play this A7. One, two, ready, play. One, and. And then we're going to switch to a D major chord, D major, so let's switch last time to, and switch, D major, we're going to move, transition into G7, so G7 is the other chord we learned last week to play that now. So one more time right here. And and switch G7. G7. And we're gonna go back to A7. So we're playing our second finger on the fourth string, second fret, third finger, second string, second fret. Switching to A7 right here. Switch. time, last measure, and we're done. Great. E uh, A7 and G7, we played a little bit of D in there, but um, we've played those two chords now for week six um, review. And um, again, we also had those bar chords, but we don't need to look back at that. We basically um, understood that we have uh, bar chord uh, patterns, and we're going to move those based on the root. And so that's a really valuable tool that we will pick back up um, in the future. Um, we'll look a little bit at that, um, I believe in week eight, let's see here. We'll look at, um, yeah, we'll look at transposing keys in week eight, and then we'll get more into capos in the advanced book. So um, we'll go back to that. Today we're going to talk about um, baseline walkdowns.